Let's talk about pictorial drawings. There are three types, which are isometric, oblique, and perspective. Each type shows a 3D representation of an object, but accomplishes it in a different way. To begin with, you have isometric drawings. They do a great job of showing exactly what an object looks like to scale or to actual size, and they show the true dimensions through width, height, and depth of an actual object. They're easy to understand, quick to produce, and widely available. And unlike other pictorial drawings, it stands alone. There's no other subsets of isometric drawings. Oblique drawings do have two different subsets. They have cavalier and cabinet. Generally, these drawings are drawn with true height and width, but the depths can vary. On a cavalier drawing, the depth is true and the image looks a little bit distorted. On a cabinet drawing, the depth is halved. And what this does is allow the object to look a little bit more realistic to what it actually is. The final type of pictorial drawing is perspective drawing. It comes in three different variations of one, two, and three point perspective drawings. In a one point perspective drawing, you get true height and you get true width, but the depth is up to the creator. In a two point perspective drawing, you get true height, but width and depth are left up to the creator. And on three point, it's really a more artistic rendition of what's going on, where you don't get true height, depth, or width. All of the different pictorial drawings can be used to communicate ideas in different ways and are used by many different professions, including engineers, artists, and the list goes on and on. In future videos, I'll cover how to create each of the pictorial types of drawings to represent objects in the way that you find best for communicating your ideas.